Hello friends, welcome to engineering tutorial. Uh, in my previous uh, few videos, we discussed about the conversion, the interconversion from binary to decimal, decimal to binary and then from decimal to hexadecimal, hexadecimal to decimal, then decimal to octal and octal to decimal. We discussed these three interconversion techniques. In today's video, we are going to study about octal to binary conversion. Uh, how to convert an octal number or a number in base 8 system into binary form, its equivalent binary form or base 2 form. So, before we uh, go deep into this, we must first understand something about the octal number system and how it can be related with the binary number system. Now, in octal number system, seven uh, sorry, eight symbols are used. Okay, in octal, eight symbols are used. Okay, zero, one, two, three then uh, 4, 5, 6 and 7. These 8 symbols are used from 0 to 7. Now, if we want to represent the same symbols in their equivalent binary form, suppose we want to represent the same symbols in their equivalent binary form. How can we do that? Let us see. We want to represent these same symbols in binary form. Now, we can write 0 as 0, 0, 0. It is in the binary representation, the 3 bit binary representation. And why we are using 3 bits, I will also come to that. 1 can be written as 0, 0, 1. 2 can be written as 0, 1, 0. 3 can be written as 0, 1, 1. 4 can be written as 1, 0, 0, <coughs> sorry, 5 can be written as 1, 0, 1, 6 can be written as 1, 1, 0 and 7 can be written as 1, 1, 1, okay. So, this is the binary representation of each of the 8 symbols that are used in the octal system and why we are using 3 bits. Now, in the octal system, there are a total of 8 symbols, ok. There are a total of 8 symbols, which is 2 to the power 3, which means that in binary system, we will require 3 bits, ok, at least 3 bits to represent all of the symbols of octal system. It cannot be done using 2 bits. It cannot be done using 2 bits. Up in using 2 bits, we can only represent up to 3. We can only write up to 3. 4 cannot be represented using 2 bits. So, we require 3 bits and up to 7, we get the maximum value that is 1, 1 and 1. When we, when we go to 8, okay, that is whenever we go for decimal or hexadecimal system where 8 is allowed, we would require 4 bits. But for the octal system symbols, we at least require 3 bits, okay, to represent all the octal symbols, okay, 3 bits. So, always remember in octal to binary or binary to octal conversion, each of this symbol of the octal system should be represented using 3-bit binary 
uh, grouping okay and vice versa for binary to octal conversion we will go into that so three bits okay three bit binary combinations are used to represent each of the symbols of octal system this is important okay now let us see how we can convert a given octal number into binary form okay let us see <clears throat> now we will see how we can convert a given octal number into binary form okay so the first example which we will take is let's say 1 3 okay in octal form and we have to convert it into equivalent binary representation now 1 3 both these symbols 1 and 3 are allowed in the octal system because they are within 0 and 7 so it is a valid octal number now I just told you that in order to convert a given octal number into binary form we have to represent each digit of the octal number using 3 bit binary groupings ok let us see how we will do that write the number the octal number the individual digits 1 and 3 now this 1 in binary form it can be written as 0 0 1 1 can be written as 0 0 1 we just uh, we just saw that in the table from binary to octal and octal to binary conversion 1 can be written in binary form as 0 0 1 3 can be written as 1 sorry uh, 0 1 1 3 can be written as 0 1 1 1 as 0 0 1 and 3 as 0 1 1 <coughs> now we combine these two so 1 3 in octal form can be written as 0 0 1 0 1 1 okay 0 0 1 0 1 1 this <coughs> is for 1 this 3 bit grouping 0 0 1 is for represents 1 and this 3 bit grouping it represents 3 okay here yeah. 1 and 3 so this is how you do you take each individual digit of the octal number and represent it in terms of 3 bit binary representation and you then combine them ok so let us take another example Let us take, uh, let us say, uh, 25, okay, 25 in octal, we have to convert it into binary form, okay. Now, the same thing we have to do, we have to write 2 and 5 separately, each of the two symbols are allowed in the octal system, that is the first thing which we have to check, we just for our uh, assurance. 2 and 5 are within 0 and 7 so it is a valid octal number then we have to represent each digit of the octal number in terms of 3 bit binary uh, representation 2 in binary form can be written as 0 1 0 5 can be written as 1 0 1 ok 0 1 0 for 2 and 5 4 1 0 1 so 25 combined the octal number can be represented as 0 1 0 1 0 1 in binary form okay this is for 2 
and this is for 5 ok 2 and 5 let us take another example <coughs> Uh, let's say 140, 140, okay, in octal we have to convert it into binary form. So, we have to write each digit of the octal number separately. 1 can be written as 0, 0, 1, 4 can be written as 1 0 0 0 can be written as 0 0 0 ok this is for 1 this is for 4 and this is for 0 now all you have to do is that we have to combine them 1 4 0 in octal form can be represented as 0 0 1 1 0 0 0 0 0 to represent in binary this is 1 this is 4 and this is 0 ok always remember to form 3 bit combinations binary combinations for each uh, octal digit ok now let us take another example, a uh, four uh, digit example, okay. Let us say seven, five, two, six, it is a given octal number and we have to convert it into binary form. Now, you have to write 7, 5, 2 and 6 uh, in separately and represent each of the octal digit in binary form, 3 bit binary form, 1, 1, 1, 7 can be written as 1, 1, 1, 5 can be written as 1, 0, 1, 2 can be written as 0, 1, 0 and 6 can be written as 1, 1, 0. <coughs> okay. So, when we combine them 7, 5, 2, 6 can be represented as in binary 1, 1, 1, 1, 0, 1. 0 1 0 1 1 0 ok this is 7 this is 5 this is 2 this is for 6 7 5 2 6 it is in binary form similarly if uh, the number of uh, digits in the octal number increases but the symbols they should lie in between 0 and 7 you can represent each digit in terms of 3 bit 3 bit binary combinations it is equivalent of the, the digit octal digit. So, you represent in 3 bit binary combinations and then combine them. So, here we are we have just discussed how to convert a given octal number into its equivalent binary form. So, we have discussed some examples. So, in the next video, I will discuss about the reversing the binary to octal conversion. Okay, so, I hope you like this video and please subscribe my channel engineering tutorial for more such videos related to electrical electronics instrumentation and communication engineering. Have a great day. Thank you very much.